Hi, I'm Bob Monker, and you're watching Newcastle Fans TV. Hi everyone, just a quick one from me. We've got um, Talk Forest TV uh, who are coming on the channel. They're going to be talking quickly about the match on Wednesday um, and I'll come back to this towards the end of the video. So here it is. Pretty much will be a very interesting game. I think it will be a lot more better to get game than it was when we played you twice in December. I think Forest are a lot more set it up better than we was back in December because obviously we have changed managers twice since then. Obviously we had... Philippe Montagne in charge. Obviously, you guys went on, went and won the championship and actually got promoted. So I think when tonight's game will be a very different affair. I don't know if any of you guys have been keeping up to date with the championship scores, but obviously Forest won two and lost one after three games in the championship. Obviously, we beat Shrews being the first one off the top as well. Um, Forest have been playing reasonably well, but we have started to get better, especially with our point performances against Brentford, Barnsley and um, Middlesbrough on Saturday, the easy rivals. I bet you guys are actually quite happy that we have beat them. Um, I think our team is getting better. They are getting used to Mark Wolverton's tactics. Obviously, he implemented most of them to actually keep us up that season and now Mark Wolverton has actually got him play, us playing really well and actually we are showing signs that we are going to be a force this season I think with our squad as well obviously we have brought in quite a few new signs with Boots Lackey S. Murphy who came from New South he is starting to store some goals for us which is quite nice to see um, we brought Daryl Racker in um, so I think some of the signing staff implemented themselves really well and I think hopefully going into the game against you guys on Wednesday night I think it will be a tough game. I've been watching your games as well which shows that you guys are doing a lot but it's one of them ones it's early in the season, it's the second round of the cup. Both teams will be wanting to maintain the momentum or start to build it. I'd like to say thank you for um leave for letting me come on to the show if you want to see more forest's content please do um go to talk forest tv and give us a sub so that's their thoughts i do think um newcastle will 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 history change it we'll have a lot of uh, fresh players coming in a lot of fringe players so you probably see the likes of gamers and carl darlow and and ben bastard and center back rather than left back at the weekend and so on and so on we'll see some fringe players hopefully we'll see some youngsters the likes of dan barleza el marnie fernandez hopefully get an appearance off the bench we will stick up i think this has come at the right time for newcastle massively because we're we've been so frustrated the first two games and we've got the hooks uh, the, the, the shackles so to speak are off and we're going to go full belt against Forrest obviously Darren Murphy will he, will he play or not is another question will he haunt us hopefully not but it's a chance for Newcastle just to play for a bit of freedom and get a bit of confidence going into the West Ham game but let us know what you think of uh, that and head over to uh, Talk Forest TV as well they do some great content as well thanks lads for coming on as well see you later bye bye